good effort. I'll give you a B. I have a message from Professor Snape. He wants to remind you all that your next potions lesson is coming up shortly, and there will be house points deducted if any of you forget your ingredients. That is all for today. Class dismissed. Welcome back to the Harry Potter and the Flowers of Stone on the PlayStation 2 walkthrough. 100% walkthrough, actually. I have to remember to say that. Mm, this part 10. And now we're back uh, after the uh, Spongify oh, spell nice. challenge. I almost, I almost said Spotify actually. Mm, um, yeah. Marmalade. Flitwick just um, shared with us a message from Professor Snape and that we have to collect our potion ingredients before a potion class tomorrow. So that is actually what we're going to do in this part. We are going to collect the rest of the potion ingredients. To make sure we have all of those. And there we got a wizard card, which is Sirs. And then just some beans here. And now we're going to talk to Ron. Harry, you heard what Professor Flitwick said. We'd better get those ingredients of potions. Professor Snape, he doesn't want to teach potions. Everyone knows he's after Quirrell's job. Knows an awful lot about the dark art, Snape. I'll meet you at Hagrid's. Yeah, so we'll go to Hagrid's. Out of the door, which he's doing very slowly for some reason. And I have to sneeze. Let's try to hold that back. But yeah. I don't know what's my problem. I sound really yeah. awkward yeah. right now. I don't know why. But now we're going to go outside to the grounds. We're going to go to Hagrid's garden. Well, first we're going to go and visit Hagrid's first though. So go to Hagrid's hut. Down to the bottom, just down here. Get some pretty pots, every favorite beans, because we have to collect those to make sure we can buy stuff. And I haven't got this chest before. I feel like thought about it each time I went down the stairs that I have to get this chest with a wizard card but I've always just forgotten about it. A wizard card. So now I got it. And this card is Cassandra Vablatsky, who's very, very famous. And pretty much a lot of people who have read Harry Potter knows who she is. So now we're going into the entrance hall, which I really love. And you can see that Snape is standing just there. Mr. Potter, tell me, what would I get if I added powdered root of asphodel to an infusion of wormwood? I don't know, sir. Pity. Clearly fame isn't everything, is it, Mr. Potter? I do hope you manage to collect the ingredients I asked you for. I'd hate to have to deduct house points. Well, it's actually his favorite thing. I can imagine actually being a teacher and it being quite fun to deduct house points. So I think I kind of understand Snape there, even though he's very mean. Until, but he's got to be though, or he doesn't have to, but He's mean for a reason, so I'm not going to say anything more, just in case you haven't read the last Harry Potter book, which I'm guessing everyone have. I'm guessing so. And there's Hagrid, so we'll just go and talk to him. Hagrid, you know all about magical creatures. Do you know anything about that dog on the third floor? How do you know about Fluffy? Fluffy? Yeah, he's mine. Bought him off a Greek chappy I met in the pub last year. I lent him to Dumbledore to guard the... Yes? Um, never mind. That's top secret, that is. You forget that dog, and you forget what is guarded. That's between Professor Dumbledore and Nicholas Flamel. Nicholas Flamel? Why does that name sound familiar? 
shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. I think you better get your ingredients before it gets dark. Yeah, we have to collect our ingredients before it gets dark. I don't know, Hagrid has just given us a clue. The Fluffy, we don't have anything to do with Fluffy. And that business is between Professor Dumbledore and Nicholas Flamel. So now Harry has got something to think about. We'll learn more about that later though, so yep. But now we're going into Hagrid's garden. We're going to go into this house first, and it's kind of strange, this house is actually bigger than his hut, but this garden isn't just Hagrid's so. though, so it's not like he owns the garden and it's just his. I guess he kind of shares it with his school or something, he might though. We have to get these, all of these, so you can get a lot of beans. And you can see that there's a lot more lock there, so we have to use a lot more to get through. We were here the last time when we collected that ingredient through that wall where we had to use Lumos. So, equip a lot more. And you can open this door or not. Let's try again. It always fails for some reason with me. But it always works the second time. Opening the door very slowly. And now we can finally go through. And we've been thinking about going through for quite some time. So finally we can get through. And we're outside again. And here is here's some health. So that is great. Mm, chocolate. And we're going to go inside here and get the potion ingredient. Which is this one. So the potion ingredient, I can't actually remember which one it is, but it's Destiny. So that's great. Doxies! Lots of them! Yeah, here's lo lots of Doxies. We haven't met Doxies before. But we have what you have to do is to charge up your Frippenta spell and just cast it at the Doxies. And that is pretty much it. And uh, sorry about this little cut. It was just I had to go and eat dinner. So I had to stop recording, obviously. But that's okay. Um, What's the last thing? Yeah. We have a spongy file tile outside of this house, so you can use spongy file on it and have to get the last potion ingredient. So let's cast spongy file and try to jump up there. And it failed, of course. It always fails. For some reason, it always fails with me and then it works the second time, as I just said. Same with Alumora door. And now the same with a sponge of fire tile. It's very strange. And here's a folio brew tile as well. This one is the bow truckle. And the bow truckle guards the wagon weld. So wagon weld is the last potion ingredient that I have to get. So and there's bow truckles here, bow so bound to be obviously we can the find the wagon tree bark. To kill the bow chuckles, just charge up your panda spell, and that will clear them off basically, like that. And then they just kind of die, so it looks like they have a stroke or something. And here's two of them in the same area. Just be careful and not get hurt, and I'll just hit the bush with the pendo, but that gives us pretty much their flavor beam size, so it isn't that bad. Let's go over here, and there's some bow troubles there, so we'll kill them with the pendo. Like that, just one more, like so. And now we will sweep over, as you can see, 
and then just randomly there's some weird rebark on the ground. So Harry can jump over this lap, I guess, and collect the weekend tree bark, which we can view in the potions book, in the potion ingredients book. So that's all of the potion ingredients, so that's nice. I'm actually going to cut here because we've got a missing item that we have to collect. So I'm going to cut until we get here. But firstly, we're actually going to, to trade? um what trade cards. Call, sure. Trade wizard cards because as you probably noticed, you can get more than one. Sorry about my squeaky chair. You can get more than one copy of a wizard card. So what we're going to do is to trade with the cards so that we can trade away the ones that we already got. And to get different with the cards basically. We got two of Alberta two tills, so we'll change it for Thaddeus Circle. Strange name. And uh, that is that. All of them traded. All the ones that we can trade. Now, the missing item was a book. I can't remember which book it was, but it said, like, um, lost um, from an owl package or something, and it could be anywhere. So, it's hard to find when it can be everywhere, but it's just over here with a flying lesson, but through here and on this bridge. And there's the book, just waiting for us so we'll pick it up hmm. that copy of a beginner's guide to transfiguration i was looking for now i just need to return it to the common room so it was a beginner's guide to transfiguration now we know that but that is everything for the day so we'll end the day and we'll go to the house point ceremony see which house house is leading on the house points and Snape is still standing there as well. I'm guessing Gryffindor leads. But I'm going to leave you now. And hopefully you will come back for the next part. For part 11. When we will do the second night mission. Which will be exciting. See you then.